Hello there ladies and gentlemen, Sigval Grim here and welcome to another video. So, I got Spin Flaps here gearless and with Noral's Globe on him. Uh, I have him gearless because I tested him on the campaign and we'll get to that video in a second. So, I talked to him in the previous video about uh, Confluent Sakomen and uh, Deathstroke having weird interactions with the uh, Nora's Globe where they are very beneficial and Deathstroke for example is able to use his uh, whole 36% current health damage like three times and I wondered what would happen if I was to put this on Batman who laughs how would that interact with his final form so first of all we will not get more percentage health damage because for King and Deathstroke that worked because it was one of the pass it was one of the passive of the abilities for this suit is one of the passives and the clones don't copy the passives. You'll see that as I summon a clone, it's not going to fill up a bar. It's going to be a clone of Batman who laughs and not the, or, and not the final form, the Darkest Night form. Even if that's active, but if the Darkest Night form is active when we would die and get revived by Nora's globe, the clone gets tagged in and when we get tagged back in, we're going to be stuck in final form. The final form is going to be stuck at that specific point where it was in uh, terms of uh, how drained it was. It's not going to deplete even further. You're not going to be able to use specials either. You're literally going to be stuck in final form. So yeah, let's, uh, let's take a look at that happening actually. Okay, so as you can see over here, we're very close to final form and very close to dying at the same time. So we are officially in final form and we're going to let them kill me. Okay, so we're killed. This creates the copy of Venom who laughs outside the final form. He doesn't have a Christ energy bar, so the clone can't turn himself into final form. And there we go, we're back. And the energy, the crisis energy is not depleting anymore. We're not getting out of here. We are stuck for the rest of the game in final form. We are literally stuck for the rest of the game in final form. This is going to trigger yet again. As you can see, I'm using specials with the clone. It does not have a Christ energy bar. It can't turn itself into the Darkest Night form. But as this clone will die as well, you see that still I am in Darkest Night form and it's not depleting at all. So is this useful? Is this good? First up, for Arena and Champions Arena is more like annoying. But for Raisin Soul Raids, it might be good to an extent, like it's not something that's game breaking, let me get that out of the way and this is why I really really hope this is going to make it to the game because I think now that they removed the beta club interaction of Batman who laughs, they should allow him to use specials in final form anyway and that way keep the final form forever because it would still involve some gameplay that you'd have to do. So this is going to be most likely a way for you to get your percentage damage out of the way as quick as possible. Because yet again, since he doesn't work anymore with Beta Club, and a lot of you didn't have Beta Club previously anyway, the course of action with this dude will most likely be to get all your percentage health damage out of the way, and then tag in with another two characters to deal the damage. Like you have Batman Who Laughs plus Multiverse Team, Batman Who Laughs does his percentage health damage, and the Multiverse Team does the damage. This is going to be particularly useful to make sure that you need only one transition to Darkest Night form in order to get all your percentage health damage out of the way, and then you can transition quickly into using the uh, multiverse team or whatever team you're using with him to deal some damage after he's done with the percentage health. So yeah, useful in this type of way, an interesting interaction nevertheless, but I don't think it's game breaking and I really hope it doesn't get removed because it's really, really tame, but it's fun. It's definitely fun to see. With y'all having said, that was it for this one. If you enjoyed the video, make sure you subscribe and like and let me know in the comments if you knew about this or expected this. With being said, I'll hopefully see you all in the next one. Goodbye. Also, this time, this time I actually saw the comments. So, uh, a dude mentioned, because I asked about Ben Laughs in the previous video, uh, how it works. A dude actually mentioned and kind of explained as good as he could, so thank you so much my dudes, thank you so much, your explanation was enough to make me want it to actually test this out. So yeah, thank you yet again for watching, I'll see you all in the next one, goodbye! This is the future.